नमस्ते जेवियंस खुश रहो बिटिया आई जेवियन प्रीति सिंह फैकल्टी ऑफ फार्मास्यूटिकल साइंस ज्योति विद्यापीठ वुमेन्स यूनिवर्सिटी टुडे आई विल डिस्कस अबाउट द टॉपिक रिस्पॉन्स सर्फेस मैथोलॉजी रिस्पॉन्स सर्फेस मैथोलॉजी टॉपिक बिलोंग्स टू द सब्जेक्ट रिसर्च मैथोलॉजी एंड बायोस्टेट्स फॉर द बी फॉर्म एट सेमेस्टर स्टूडेंट now we come to the introduction of uh, response surface methodology response surface methodology is a collection of mathematical and stats technique uh, useful for analyzing problem where several independent variables influence dependent variables or response and the goal is to optimize this response we denote the independent variables by the x1 x2 and x3 etc it is assumed uh, that these variables are continuous and controllable by the experimenter with a negligible error the response y is the assumed to be a random variable rsm research uh, response surface methodology is used for the design and analysis of experiment uh, it seeks to relate uh, an average response to the value of quantitative variables that effect response response surface methodology answer different kind of questions such as the following uh, first one is how is particular response effect by a given set of input variables or uh, some specified reason of interest and second one is to what level is uh, what level the inputs to be controlled to give a product simultaneously satisfying desired specification and third one is uh what values of inputs will uh, will yield a maximum for a specific response and what is the nature of response surface close to the maximum so uh, this uh, these type of question related to the uh, uh, surface methodology and surface analysis methodology uh, response uh, so the v values of input in yield maximum is very important for for the for the uh, for the methodology and uh, uh, surface represented by the x and y so it is called the uh, re, uh, response surface this uh, surface is drawn between some response such as material removal rate and whose levels are denoted by the m x y whatever etc and number of quantities variables or factors whose levels are denoted by the x1 x2 and x3 the features of the surface of greatest interest is often the value of variables x1 x2 x3 for the which m is the maximum or minimum in most response surface methodology problem uh, the form of relationship between the response and the independent variables is unknown thus the first step is response surface methodology uh is to find suited approximation uh, for the true functional relationship between y and the set of independent variables usually a low order uh, polynomial in some region of the independent variable is employed if the response is well uh, well modeled by the linear function of the independent variables then the approximate approximate to, uh, for the true functional relationship between y and the set of independent variables usually a low order and polynomial in some region of the independent variables is employed if the response is well modeled is very important for the surface methodology uh, now we come to the objective first one is objective uh, selection response variables and range to be covered now we come next point construct first order model randomized and perform experiment collect data for first order model first three series lack of fit and is there lack of fit try transformation of one more variables is responses so uh, this is the uh, this is the topic of the surface methodology and this method is very uh, least square parameter it is very important for the first order design almost uh, almost the response method problem use one or both these models of course it is unlikely that a 
polynomial model will be a re reasonable approximation of the true functional relationship for the entire space of the independent variables but for a relatively small reason they usually work the method of least square is used to estimate the parameters in the approximating uh, polynomial the response surface analysis is then performed using the fitted surface if the fitted surface is an adequate approximation of the true response function then analysis of the fitted surface will be approximately equivalent to analysis of the actual system the model parameters can be estimated most effectively if proper design are used to collect the data design for the fitting response uh, response surface are co called response surface design now we come to the first order design in this case response surface fitted fitted with polynomial first degree so enumerate the first order a first order design fitting a polynomial can be treated as a particular uh, case of multiple linear regression uh, these design do not provide uh, any estimated of the experimental error variance this can be obtained by the replication of the whole experiment and by the use of an estimate from previous experimentation if there is a conv uh, convincing evidence then error variance remains stable through time so uh, if there is a no lack of fit and sufficient precision is obtained on the basis of this direction of steps and sent and determine and exploration is continued otherwise try with a transformation of one or more variables and responses careful blocking and expanding the size of design can uh, increase precision the satisfactory fit and precision is not obtainable then second order design are to be resorted first order design and second order design are also used in the also used in the response surface methodology the source of contain linear and non linear composite design also included in the uh, response surface methodology the design has a extra point uh, one for each factor and non central composite design is used when uh, 2k factorial experiment have suggested that the point of maximum response is uh, is near to one of the factor combination uh, that to, that to the center for three factor system center composite and non center composite design uh, this is the part of non uh, non central composite design so this is the complete protocol of this session this session is powered by the digital version 2.0 jyoti vidyapeeth women's university hope you are satisfied with my digital session uh, if you have any query please mention in comment box i will resolve your problem by the problem resolving classes so thank you students and thank you for the listening